Ever wondered how to record your computer screen and your webcam at the same time, just like the pros? Whether you're creating tutorials, presentations, or content for your business, nailing this skill can make your videos stand out. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to record your screen and your webcam at the exact same time using a user-friendly platform called Riverside. Let's dive in. So the first thing that you're going to do is head to riverside.fm and sign up or log in if you're already a user. I dropped the link in the description for you. And once you're logged in, create a new studio for your project. So head to this drop down menu, select new studio, and name your project. I've already created one right here, so we'll just go into that one. And then select record. In this studio, you can select whether you are or are not using headphones. From this drop down menu, you can select what camera you want to use. So maybe it's your normal webcam, or you can even connect your phone as an external webcam by just selecting this button right here. Select your microphone, whatever speakers you're using, and join the studio. When you're in the studio, you can actually invite somebody right here to come and record with you. You would just send them this link or invite them by email. Along the side here, you can check your audio levels, keep them in the green or the yellow range, try to avoid the red. And then at the bottom here, if you select share, you can share your screen. Now, if you want to share the tab audio, say you're showing a video, then you can only do this by selecting a specific tab on your browser. However, if you're not recording any audio, you can select your full window or your entire screen. Once you share your screen, you'll see that you'll be brought to that tab. So you can interact with that tab here. And when you go back into the Riverside Studio, you can see the tab right here so you can talk about it. So when you're ready to record your webcam and your screen at the same time, you would select record. The software will count down so you can get ready. And then at this point, you will be recording your screen and your webcam. You'll see at the very top of the screen, the recording is uploading. So it's currently uploading to the cloud. So this is gonna take up no space on your computer. It's also super easy to switch between layouts while you're recording with this layout button. So you can have a full screen view of your screen. You can have a picture in picture, or you can have a split screen view. This is really handy for if you're live streaming to make the stream more dynamic for your audience. But in the Riverside editor, which I will show you shortly, you can switch up your layout in post-production. So once you're done recording, hit stop, and you'll see those recordings have uploaded to the cloud. So just select view recordings. When you select the recording and you scroll down, you can download both tracks separately. So you, and if there was another participant, they would have their own downloadable track and your screen share as well. If you wanna polish this video, then select edit. Here you can take out parts of the video by highlighting the transcription, selecting delete, and that part will be deleted out of the final video. You can also customize your scenes so that the layout changes throughout the video. To do that, you would hover where you want to add a scene, select add scene, select that scene, head to layout, and choose what you want that particular scene to look like. You can also select the smart scenes button and Riverside will do this for you with AI. Speaking of AI, there are a ton of AI tools over here to help you edit your video quicker. Set pace will remove any pauses and improve the conversation flow. Smooth speech removes filler words and unwanted sounds. Magic mute is great for echo because it mutes people when they're not speaking. And magic audio can enhance your audio to studio quality. You can also do a ton of other things in the editor like add animated captions, overlay images, and add text. When your video has been edited, you would select export. You can export this video in up to 4K depending on the capabilities of the webcam you used and you can export the video. When you select go to exports, you'll be brought to that original recordings page and you'll see your edit exporting right here. When it's exported, you can preview it. Here you can preview that edit and you can download it directly to your computer. So now you know how to record your computer screen and your webcam at the same time. If you like this video and you learned something new, I would love if you hit that thumbs up button to let me know. And consider subscribing to the channel for more content just like this. And if you are a Mac user, I will leave a video for you to watch right here where I will walk you through how to screen record using the Mac app. And I'll leave a link to download the Mac app in the description of this video. Thanks so much for hanging out with me today. My name is Bridget O'Rourke and I will see you next week. Bye.